welcome. Today we're going to talk about this book that I'm carrying underneath my arm and it's... I didn't plan this so well. I'm just going to find a spot here. Right there, the perfect sun and everything. <sighs> okay, I think I should actually sit... I don't know, we're going to sit here. <laughs> and if this starts working now, then I'm fucked. <sighs> Okay, look at that, huh? perfect view. Oh, I didn't plan this so well, but we're going to talk about the Mark Gonzalez book, and that's why I'm wearing this t-shirt today. Right. Do you see it? The guns. Yep. And there is actually coffee in this. Mm. Pure skateboarder. Ah. Pure skateboarder. You should own this book. It's uh, photographs by Sam Rubio and Rissoli in New York has published this. It's like with texture, really nice uh, book. As you can see, it's it has a lot of shit in it. <laughs> has some good shit. <laughs> and uh, oh, look at the hat he has on the cover there. Kind of looks like this supreme cap. And I even have colorful shoes on me because this is a colorful man and a very huge inspiration. I will admit, when I was a kid, uh, all the older skaters were like uh, uh, super fans of Mark Gonzalez, but uh, I didn't know who he was. And I will admit, the first time I saw him skate in a video, I thought it was weird. <laughs> I didn't understand it. Like, but uh, he's not skating, he's running around on a bike. So I, I just, I didn't get it. And I, I loved uh, different skaters like Jim Greco, Steve Olsen from Shorties, uh, uh, Ali Bulala. Like I was a fan of Crazy Style and oh, of course, TNT, Tony Triello. But uh, the Mark Gonzalez thing, I didn't get it why everybody was such a fan of him, but I didn't know uh, how huge of a legend he is considering he's actually created fucking tricks and I think it's something you learn as you get older or if you see him in real life sad to say I didn't see him when I was in New York a couple of years ago but I really wish I wish I did uh, I don't want to show too much uh, of this book but I will show something that blew my mind when I saw this today uh, I went skating today at uh, Frakkeia Beton Park with uh, my good friend Selve and uh, other Hugs and Skate Rats. I'm gonna post that on my Instagram, on my story and everything. So go check that out afterwards. Uh, but I will admit I haven't been super stoked with skating lately. It's fun when I finally get out to skate. Selve is the one who gets me out to skate. So thank you Selve for always getting me stoked to skate. Because he's, he's like I used to be when I wanted to skate every day all the time. But just uh, being depressed and winter time, I just want to paint and draw, make comics and not go outside. But now, lately, uh, with Selva, when we begin to skate more street, it's been more fun. And especially when um, now it's starting to get street weather again, then of course it's more fun to skate. Because I love street skating, I don't like skating indoors, uh, the same park, the entire winter. And now with Corona and everything, it's been pretty shit. But when I read this book for breakfast today, seven in the morning, had my cup of coffee and read this and looked at the pictures, saw at the paintings, uh, it's people like Ed Templeton and uh, Jason Dill, a lot of other cool people are talking about Mark Gonzalez, how he inspires them, etc. in this book. And it got me inspired. 
so if you're uh, just a fan of skateboarding if you're a skateboarder young or old or whatever or in the middle get this book because I'm not saying this is not sponsored I paid for it for with my own money but this book is worth having it's a major inspiration so it got me stoked to skate today and uh, we took some fun photos at, uh, at the Fakaya Beton Park and a little bit cool street like shitty street spots that I love to skate uh, so when the world opens up again, I can't wait to go out and travel and skate spots and just I want to go back to New York again and not vlog every day, but just film and have fun and Hopefully this summer I will try to make a new video parts of skateboarding because I love doing those So yeah, if you would like to see a new skateboard part by me write in the comments below. I need the inspiration or I need the motivation Okay, I'm gonna show you some of this Starts off from yellow. Uh, the forwards is by Mark and T. Gonzalez, his wife. And here you can you can freeze this photo to see all the people that are in the book. It's like Ed Templeton, Tony Hawk, uh, Neil Blender, Bill Strobeck, Jason Dill, Jim Thibault, uh, Blondie McCoy, Jason Lee, Spike Jones. A lot of people. A lot of cool people. Just this photo alone makes me want to go out and skate um, and a lot of cool like handwritten uh, stuff by Mark this is fucking amazing this photo right here oh my god so I've always been a fan of uh, artsy skate photos or the aesthetics of a skate photo I don't give a fuck if it's a good trick or not if it looks good in a photo or on video then that's what's important to me fun fact Right behind me up here in the streets, I will see if I can get that photo. It's really old, but it was a, f a photo taken by André Ristesund, uh, uh, a DJ actually in Haugesund. But he also did this art magazine and photos, and he took a photo of, I think, the only frontside nose slide, because I never managed to learn them properly. But I did a frontside nose slide on this really raw, uh, sketchy uh, curb up in the streets, and then you roll down the streets. But that's one of my favorite photos because he's not a skateboarder so he took the photo very differently than what other people would have done so i'm gonna see if i can get that there's amazing with a templeton also got one of his books recently i uh, love this as well mark in the studio painting uh, a lot of good inspiring interviews and the cool thing with mark gonzalez like Okay, this is fucked up. This is when both Tony Hawk and him were like, like posing in 50, being 50 year old. And he's doing a fucking air with that rocket ship of the skateboard. And he met up late, so Tony only had like 20 minutes to shoot this photo. And he was, and Mark was gonna set up this crazy board. And he lost the hardware and the tools in the bottom of the pool. Tony was just standing there like, Oh my god we're never gonna get this done because <laughs> he's always late Mark Gonzalez which I'm too the friends who know me and um, he set the board up and he did this fucking boneless over Tony Hawk in a vert bowl of concrete fucking Jesus that alone should inspire everyone especially if when somebody asks me aren't you a little bit old to be skating still uh, apparently not this is also amazing and I love his style though, that's why I'm going a little bit colorful today. You will see that on my Instagram post as well. The hoodie I chose today to wear, it was inspired by Mark Gonzalez, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of cool, the paintings, about the skateboards. Uh, my favorite interview is one of my favorite skaters of all time with Jason Dill. Uh, but I'm gonna jump straight to, I actually almost cried because I'm so proud very proud um, I hope this is me by the way when I get old still skating still being crazy I'm not comparing myself to Mark Gonzalez in any way well I am but I'm not saying that I'm like that I am him or uh, all that but I paint I draw I skate I make music performance so I see a lot of similarities and that inspires me to do even more uh, 
as I said, I was just flipping through this book before I went out now. I was actually going to save some of the pages till later. Because uh, I just came from skating today. And then I saw this. Oh my god, this is... It's unbelievable. Oh, where is it? I just saw it here. I knew I should have <laughs> taken a post-it or something. <laughs> the pages. But I didn't. Where is it? Uh, come on. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Sorry for this. I just think of something beautiful as I'm going through this. The cool thing with skating though, like right now the whole vlogging thing that I quit doing, uh, speaking among people, okay, there it is. But now I'm so stoked because I've been skating today and I did some tricks. Okay, this is fucking insane. This is the Mark Gonzalez book. And here's my homie, Heito da Silva. Recently just became pro for Palace Skateboards. And he's from here. Like, he literally lives five minutes walk from the Fakaya Beton Park where I skated today. He's in Mark Gonzalez's fucking book. And of all the people that's standing in this photo, who is Mark looking at? Young Gun, Heito da Silva. My man, my brother, my friend. Very proud of you, Eito. It's insane, you're actually doing what I was dreaming about as a kid, but you're fucking skating with the guns. You're a legend, Eito, just like the guns. That's why he's looking at you, because he knows you're an up-and-coming legend, and I'm proud to be your friend. And if that wasn't enough, keep on turning these pages. So much inspiration, and then fucking Heito is always here. He's also here. Look at that sexy motherfucker. And if you uh, get those palace boards of Heito da Silva, I'm gonna get them myself and have them on the wall. You're gonna sign them, Heito. But he's two photos of Heito in the Mark Gonzalez Rissoli New York book. Very proud of you, Heito, and congratulations, Mark, on this fucking epic work. And uh, good job, Sam Rubio. This book is a must have for everybody who is interested in skateboarding in some way or another. Fuck your digital shit. Get the book. And it's beautiful, it has like this uh, texture. And and I can, re I can end by reading this funny thing on the back. He's even misspelled uh, uh, stuff on purpose. Uh, now, not only am I published, but published in three languages. I, now, I know my teachers would be happy I'm speaking French now. I miss you, Miss Arnold. <laughs> Mark Gonzalez of the Sully book, a fucking legendary man an amazing book and a must have for all skateboarders i'm gonna go to my studio now set up a new deck and uh, paint on my grip tip i will post it when it's done have a nice easter everybody and um, uh, every friday a new video here on my youtube channel write in the comments below if it's something you think i should check out or books or videos or uh, vinyl whatever and every friday also i do a live stream on my instagram at 13100 utc plus one so go to my instagram for more info on that and uh i want to see more skateboarding from you people who skate so send me a dm on instagram or tag me in your skate things uh, gotta make some new stickers uh, asap so i can give them to you at the skate park hope to skate with all of you soon and uh, really looking forward to skate more this summer Thank you, Mark, for inspiring me. Hey, Thor and Silva. Peace out. Peace.